tutorial video, you will learn how to create a custom view to display the data on your calendar. First, you must ensure that the Calendar tab on your ribbon is selected. Next, you must click Create View under the Manage View section. The option to create a new view is not just specific to calendar lists. You can use the Create View option with several types of SharePoint lists. For this example, let's choose the Calendar View type. Let's name our new view, My View. In the View settings, you have the option of changing the default scope of the calendar to either day, week, or month. The default view when a new calendar is created is the month view. In our new view, let's change the scope to weekly. We can modify the view further by adding filters. Let's modify this view by adding a filter to show only items that I have created or modified. Use square brackets to define the parameters of your filter. Once you are happy with your changes, click OK to save your modified view. Our new view has been successfully created. You will see that this calendar is now in a weekly view and has only items that I have personally created or modified. To switch between different views, ensure that you're on the Calendar tab. Under Current View, there's a drop-down menu. You can see that we're currently in My View. To change back to the default, simply click Calendar. You may also modify your view after it has been created. Ensure your view is selected from the drop-down menu and select Modify View. In the View options, you can choose a URL for your new view. Remember that you can bookmark this URL for easy access in the future. You will also notice that there is the option to delete our view. Thank you for watching this tutorial video. For more videos like these, please go to the Corporate Internet YouTube channel.